Hello, good morning. It's science time. <laughs> Every day you eat food. We eat food. Sometimes fruits, sometimes meat, sometimes chicken, sometimes fish. Oh, I love that. Sometimes bread, cakes, noodles, and something a lot of sweet foods. All of us enjoying eating our food every day. But did you know where does the food go after swallowing them? How does the food turn into nutrients and distributed into the different parts of your body? Now, that's what we will be going to learn today. So, are you ready? It's science time and let's learn about digestive system. Let's talk first about digestion. Digestion is the process of breaking down the food into a form that can be absorbed for the use of the body. Digestion starts in the mouth. Your teeth cut and grind the food. The food is changed into soluble forms and the saliva softens the food. The partially digested food enters the esophagus. It is a long muscular tube that carries the food from the mouth to the stomach. When we swallow, there is a rhythmic wave-like muscle movement that pushes down the food to the stomach and is called peristalsis. The food now goes down to the stomach and digestion in the stomach usually takes from 2 to 3 hours before it passes through an opening leading to the small intestine. The food is further changed into liquid form in the small intestine and then your liver produces bile, mixes with fats and breaks them down. In your small intestine, there are tiny projections found in the surface lining of small intestine that allow much digested food to be absorbed into the blood and distributed to the different parts of the body and it is called your villi or villi. The undigested materials enter the large intestine and it is also a temporary storage of water. Undigested food becomes part of the waste that comes out of the body. Your rectum stores it and eliminated by anus called defecation or bowel movement. That's how the digestive system works. We eat, then our digestive system organs digest the food, and then we poo. Ew! Then we eat again, then it will be digested again, and then we poo. It's just like a cycle every day, that's why we should eat regularly and eat healthy foods, most especially fruits and vegetables, so that our body functions very well.
That's all for today. Hope you learned something new and see you again next time. And always remember, knowledge is power. Bye-bye!